Hello, welcome to the latest breaking news. In this video, you will see important news on use of trending and breaking. Please like this video, subscribe this channel. Keith Urban says Miley Cyrus sounds like an ashtray. And I mean that as a compliment. Keith Urban is giving Miley Cyrus and her smoky scene voice their flowers. On the latest episode of the Australian podcast Fitzy and Whippa with Kate Ritchie, the country singer-songwriter praised the pop star by comparing her distinctive voice to a tobacco receptacle. I've always loved Miley. I love her voice, man, Urban said when asked about his fellow musician. She sounds like an ashtray. And I mean that as a compliment. I literally mean that as a compliment. Irvin's praise came after he launched into a brief cover of Cyrus' hit single Flowers from her eighth studio album, Endless Summer Vacation. Well, if Cyrus is an ashtray, the host asked, then what is Tom Waits? I mean, he's just the nicotine, Urban quit. He's all the yellow stuff in the cigarettes. Urban is a well-documented fan of the pop girlies, having previously praised the likes of Taylor Swift and Ariana Grande. And who could forget the time the unwittingly hard-launched Foo Bridgers and Bo Burnham's relationship during the Philadelphia leg of Swift's era's tour? The country crooner, attending alongside wife Nicole Kidman, inadvertently captured the two engaging in PEA while filming himself enjoying the show. Fove, I'm so sorry, Urban said of the viral moment while speaking with Entertainment Tonight at CMA Fest last year. It felt very awkward. I felt bad. I was just digging on the concert. You never know what's going to happen. Urban is gearing up for the release of his 11th studio album, Hi, App September 20. He released the album's lead single, Straight Line, earlier this year. The four-time Grammy winner also recently announced his High and Alive tour, set to commence in August 2025 in span arenas across Australia. He'll be joined by special guest Chase Matthew. Before then, though, he's set to bring High to Las Vegas with a 10-date limited engagement inside Blue Leaf Theatre in the Fontainebleau between October and February.